Hello and welcome to the December plan with me video. It is the last one for 2022. I really did a plan with me for every single month. Now was I consistently planning every month? Well, we'll talk about that in another video. <laughs> I just really need to say welcome back to the seasoned vets in the game. Do you miss the voiceovers like I do? Because I quietly think it's my thing for the plan with me's anyway. And to the new subscribers, welcome. Get comfortable. Grab your wine and your snacks or your tea or your coffee. Let's get into the December plan with me. For quite some time, I've been talking about regaining focus and being motivated to plan. This is a quote that I find very fitting for that. When we focus on perfection, we will be forever frustrated. When we focus on progress, we feel invigorated by Jeff Shore. Now what you didn't hear after I read that was me snapping like I'm at a poetry slam. This quote really hit me upside the head. I'm human and I need to remind myself of that. I am not some superhero on a cartoon or in a comic strip. I can only do so much with the amount of hours that I have in the day, with the amount of energy that I have in my body. And with that, this quote is very fitting in more than one area within my life. Here is another month of me fighting for my life with these late days. That just means that I start work one hour later and I know that for some people you think that means sleeping in, but have you driven in Atlanta? And let me put this out in the universe. I am merely making an observation, not a complaint, because I know for sure where I moved to and what I was expecting. Anyway, this is a Papermate Inkjoy in 1.0. I prefer the 1.0 because of how I hold the pen versus the 0 0.7 which majority of planner people use but I hold the pen at a dangerous slant I believe so that's why it doesn't look the same when I use the 0 0.7 in my opinion Let's move on. Lisa's birthday is coming up. We gift each other experiences. If you've seen the Where Did the Money Go video, then you know what she gave me for my birthday. And we'll see what I get her for hers. I have no idea why my camera insists on swinging from left to right right now, but bear with me. After I put in all of my important dates, I do want to talk about some of the things that I have on my to-do list. I know that I want to be more active on TikTok. I do want to post more over there. I also want to have a couple of photo shoots with Kay. We've done this in the past, but we really said we were going to tighten up and I don't know, we haven't scheduled anything yet, but we will. I need to get to sleep early enough so that my workouts can be in the morning again. I miss my morning workouts. I know that I'm starting the month with a bang with double uploads over the weekend, but I'm not getting too excited yet because some of these videos were meant for November. If you've been here for quite a few years, then you know about my old car. I still have it. I tried selling it and the amount that they were offering was ridiculous. So I'm going to donate it, hopefully. And because of the double sofa situation going on downstairs right now, I am going to hopefully sell it. So wish me luck on selling my emerald green sofa. It's beautiful, but I have two of them and I only need one. I could make a list of things that I think real adults have or do. I'm just going to say having a tailor is one of them. I feel like real full grown adults that have their lives together have tailors and seamstresses. If I'm wrong, let me know. I also think full grown adults do not wait until the morning of work to get gas. They actually do it in preparation of the work day. I am not a full grown adult yet. I don't care what my age is. I still wait until the morning of. What prompted me to get a tailor were these particular pair of pants that I purchased and then I returned, then I purchased again because I really did like the fit of the pants, but the length was outrageous. I'm 5'8". If anything, I go for a tall, 
but the regular was underneath my foot. And if I put on heels, I mean, I would still be grazing the ground with the hem of the pants? Outrageous. Anyway, enough of the pants. I'm looking for a tailor. Now, I'm also needing to refresh my pantry. I need to do a full-on declutter and restock. Also want to find finance inserts that make sense because I have a few that I really do love, but the way I'm restructuring my planner and my planning process, I need finance inserts that will complement that. I also have a YouTube schedule that I've been toying around with. I haven't put it into action yet, but after the December plan with me, then we'll see if I can stick to that schedule. I also want 15 workouts done this month. I'm going to log it on a weekly basis, so one to seven, 8 to 14 and so on. During this holiday season, I would love to get into baking again. I would like to at least get two recipes, something that my aunt used to make. So look out for that. And now we're going into my monthly overview. I think, I think what I'm going to do moving forward is have my monthly overview become my YouTube calendar and my workout calendar tracker, if you will because I need to see the progress on paper. Immediately no. Immediately no. E immediately no. You are watching a fool at work. Why didn't I put down the icon sticker before I started writing? It's as big as a house in that square. It is too big. Not feeling the vibes. Don't like it. No. <laughs> just, just no. Yeah, take that off. No. While I struggle to take this off, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the comments. I will see you in the community tab. And let me go ahead and give you a quick little flip of what we've done. And you see I went back to my old faithful squares because what was that? What was that? <laughs> Who's behind?